I'm here to talk about DNA gene therapy. This is a formulation that we have, which is called MANA. And with over 20 years of research, using it with over 12,000 patients in the last nine years, we have seen huge success. We take one drop of the patient's own blood. This brings back the patient's own fetal or healthy DNA, which we give it back as injections immediately to the patient on a subcutaneous plane. With this technology, we have been able to treat various diseases from diabetes to hypertension to heart problem to eye problem, blindness, arthritis, whichever way that we want to look at it. It's an anti-aging or a regenerative technology. This was a space which was called stem cells earlier. Now we are taking this into a more 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 specific molecular level. Stem cell was still cell based. So the cell itself would be changed. But ultimately when it went into the patient, it would be the DNA of that stem cell which would be utilized. Here on a molecular level, we are able to see and make sure that it is the patient's own fetal or healthy DNA. So the hunt for this mechanism has now reduced and that raw stock is coming from the own patient. In medicine, we have so many chemicals and we have so many injections. The highest form of allopathic medicine is an injection. Yes, there are tablets, there are a lot of other things, but it is so common. That means your body, my body, his body, everybody should have only one drug. For example, aspirin or paracetamol or ciprofloxin. We need these as well. But when we talk customization and we are taking the patient's own blood, making his DNA and giving it back as an injection, it's the highest form of medicine and one that has been used by us for over nine years.